What's going on? It's your boy Joe, and today, today, your boy Joe, man, I gotta come out here. We gotta come out here, you know what I'm saying, and let y'all know what's going on with my bill. You know what I'm saying? I gotta let y'all know what's going on with my boy. Um, I am a 91 overall with him, and I'm a 684. They call my build a 6'8 per sharpshooter, but I mean, you can call them that. I mean, I'm not that, but I mean, they call the build a, um, a three level score, but I call them a, a per sharpshooter. You know what I'm saying? But um, enough of me talking, bro. Let's get right into it. I gotta say one more thing, though. My bad to all myself that I didn't really been drop this video. Um, it's just that I, would, I just really like to take my time with the SIGs and my animations and my jump shot to let y'all know that. They nice and it's just they not counterfeit. You know what I'm saying? So let's get right into it though, bro. So uh as you can see, my boy, well, let me move this out the way for y'all, bro. So, as y'all can see, my boy is a 91. You know what I'm saying? Uh getting 91 with this build, bro. Uh they did they did triple bar me. They did triple bar me, so I'm 93.9, so who knows, but they might um I might be just be a 92 off this one, you know what I'm saying? So, the progression. So, um, I dropped a video. It's in a link, and uh, it's in the link in the it's in the link in the description down below. So y'all can really test out like how I did the attribute caps for this build if you really wanted to look at it. But um, before y'all really make this build, I'm gonna tell y'all one thing, and I'm gonna talk about this in another video. Don't get me wrong. Calm down. Calm down. You hear me? The build go crazy. But one thing that I just wish I would have did differently is dropping my post hook and putting some of that on my defense. You know what I'm saying? So having my post hook up so high and having my close shot up so high, that's why they call it the build a three level score. But I mean, he can't really slash too efficiently in the paint, but I mean, that's what they call it. You know what I'm saying? But um, my close shot, it's my driving layup, my driving dunk, my standing dunk, my post hook, it's my mid range. That's my three point and my free throw post fade. You know what I'm saying? They go to passes, the ball handling, the post moves, and my defense. You know what I'm saying? It ain't too high. You know what I'm saying? I wish I would've um like I said put some more defense on them, but you learn from your mistakes though. If y'all wanna make this build, I highly recommend you to put put the more attributes on your defense. You know what I'm saying? At least on your perimeter and interior, you know? So let's look at the badges. Y'all wanna see my badges, you know what I'm saying? So uh we don't got no finishing badges yet. But uh, like I said again, I gotta mention this. So with me having my um, my post hook up, my post hook up so high, they gave me more slashing badges, and I can see that's what that's why they call this build a three level score. But and you know, like we're really like with me playing with this build and really grinding with him, y'all. I mean, he can slash in the paint, but it's like you gotta make sure you can get you gotta make sure you can get an opening off whatever you do. You do, you do a euro. You gotta make sure you get an opening. You do a hop step, you gotta make sure you can do an opening because you can't really get like contact layups with a 67 driving layup. You know what I'm saying? But I got eight slashing bags. I haven't really been working towards my finishing too much. Uh, my shooting, that's what I've really been grinding towards. Uh, and then with this build, these are the badges that we're working with right now. Uh, in the video that you was just watching, at the time, uh, I did have gold catch and shoot, gold uh, deep range dead eye, and uh, gold range extender. But I think for another part in the video, I think I labeled it. You know what I'm saying? Um, I didn't have, I didn't, I didn't, I don't think I had catch and shoot silver. I just had like my main three core badges: catch and shoot, dead eye, and range extender. I had silver. You know what I'm saying? But like I said again, in the second half, these are all the badges that we had. You know what I'm saying? But uh, we gonna keep grinding, and we gonna get all of them Hall of Fame really soon. Uh, with my playmaking, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we can get 14 badges. You know, I haven't really been working towards that. Like I said, we just been really working towards the shooting. And uh, let's show y'all the six. You know what I'm saying? I gotta show y'all the six. You know what I'm saying? So, when it comes down to the six, you know what I'm saying? Let me show y'all. You know? So, uh, when it came to making the jump shots with this build, I'm gonna let y'all know some burners right now. Now, look. Now, in the clip that you were just looking at, um, when I was in a wreck, the jump shot that I was using was base 38 with Kobe, 
uh, I didn't blend like it's the same jumper and a quick tip for y'all if you ever play in 2k you make a jump shot uh, for the release and for the release one and release two if you're using the same jump shot don't blend it bro just keep it regular you know what I'm saying you're gonna mess up your jump shot you know but I'm using base 38 and Kobe uh, I had silver quick draw and um do I plan on getting the gold soon maybe but I'll let y'all know if we do that and uh, don't really pay attention to these burners right here um, I haven't really tested these like that. These was jump shots that I made at the beginning of the game. You know what I'm saying? But uh, don't really, like I said, don't copy those. Uh, I'm going to have like another video really just talking about blends. You know what I'm saying? Really just talking about a lot of jump shot blends to go crazy. You know what I'm saying? But if y'all really need like just some releases just straight off the back that you can use to go crazy, bro. You can use Kobe. That one is wet. You know what I'm saying? You can use Rudy Gay if you want to, but I highly recommend you to get your quick draw max because it's a slow jumper, but it's wet though. Uh, you can use Vince Carter, you can use John Wall, you can use KD. Shout out to my boy Chico, man. He was using his jump shot and going crazy. You know what I'm saying? My boy was getting straight greens. He was getting straight greens with a point guard using KD. How? My boy knows he know his jumper. You know what I'm saying? He know his jumper, right? So look. You, you can use KD, um, like I said again, Rudy Gay. Uh, if you're not really like a good person to shoot like moving mid range or just like moving shots in general, you can use Paul George, bro. Uh, Paul George is a really good just catch and shoot jumper. Can't go wrong with it. And uh, that's about it. You know, I'm not gonna really talk about the other. One. Oh yeah, and Damian Lillard too. So that's another one that's uh, that's cash. You know what I'm saying? And that that's really about it. Um, just stay tuned, y'all. If y'all new, bro, I'm gonna have a jump shot video up immediately. You know what I'm saying? So stay tuned for that. So, my free throws, I got on Kobe. You know what I'm saying? My pull-ups with this jump shot. So, um, when it came to using this jump shot, y'all, base 38, Kobe, Kobe. Um, I was using Athletic 2. That was kind of the one that works the best for me. Remember, y'all, if you're a shot creator out there, you got to make sure that when you using these dribble pull-ups, you got to make sure that the base correlates with your jumper. You know what I'm saying? That's how you get greens. Right. So, the only one that I was using was Athletic 2. Uh, if y'all need something to go crazy, bro, um, you can try Athletic 3. You can try out 4. It might work for you. You can put on 5. And you can try out 6 and 7. I don't like 8 or 9. You know what I'm saying? It might work for you, but I'm not really a, a big fan of those two uh, dribble pull-ups. You know what I'm saying? Uh, my spin jumper. Now, when it comes to this spin jumper, I'm warning y'all. If you want to put on this spin jumper, this spin jumper, I like I like that and I be getting greens off of it, bro. But the thing with this spin jumper is that it, it's meant for you to, to create as much space as possible. If you got somebody on you in the wreck or in the park that's, that's guarding you really closely, bro, you hit it and you're going to create a lot of space. But it's kind of like a little funny to time. But if you can get the timing down right, you can get greens off of it. And... I, I would try to try to make sure you got a high mid range. You know what I'm saying? You can put it on with an 80 mid range or like a 85. It don't matter, but just it's, it's gonna be hard. I'm warning you. You gotta make sure you can time it correctly. But the benefits of the benefits of this uh, spin jumper, y'all, you create a lot of space, bro. Now, if you don't really like the spin jumper, it's a lot of spin jumper, y'all. You, you can just put on like any quick one. You know what I'm saying? Uh, my hop jumpers. You know what I'm saying? So look, when it comes to the hop jumpers, bro, the one that's your boy Joe. Rocking with, well, I got on normal eight, bro. Um, the really the two that I really uh, rock with, and I got a lot of uh, a lot about the hop jumpers and just a lot about the animations in general in the comment section below. So check that out. I got like an entire list about all the hop jumpers. You know what I'm saying? But the one that we really rocking with is a uh, normal eight. I don't really find myself using nine like that. I just like uh, eight, but nine is cool though. I like nine because if you pay attention, just give me one. Look at them for a minute. Let's look at him. He do this one little move where he do like a like a step back and he go like you see look he just did. I went did exactly what I did. You know what I'm saying? Look, he he do like a little hezzy and you can you can fool your defender with it, but you gotta be careful because you might get blocked. You know what I'm saying? But I found myself I always use normal A because I like how I like I like a lot of a lot of the hop steps hop the hop step jumpers that he do. I can't talk. But um and also, he also do like a little James Harden step back. So if you running, if you flick back and click X, bro, he gonna he gonna do a little step back and he gonna pull up, bro. I'm telling you, if you learn how to master it, bro, you gonna make a lot of people mad. You know what I'm saying? But my post fade, I got on post, I got on five. 
For post hooks, I got on three. My post hop set, I got on eight. My post semi fades, I got on three. And my post semi hooks, we got on three. Now, my dribble style is James Harden. Now, y'all can correct me on this, bro. I don't know if I'm correct. You know what I'm saying? But look, though. When it comes to the dribble styles, I personally think that the dribble style is is mainly like your posture and how, on, on how you holding the ball. You know what I'm saying? And how, like, and just how you dribble with the left stick. If I'm wrong about that, let me know. But it's real clean, though. You know what I'm saying? I like James Harden. Uh, move. Do you use any other ones? No. Nah. Um, I was using Paul George. You can try out Paul George if you want to, but I really like James Harden. Uh, like his left stick dribbling. That's what I call it, bro. That's just basically what it is. That's like your posture on how you holding the ball. And certain animations you're going to do when you flicking the left stick. When you're moving. And, uh, yeah, it's clean. It's just like a lot of the stuff that he do. Like, it's like he meant. Like, he always trying to set himself up open to shoot. So, like, for example, right? Um, Like, I be in Rackin Park. I be coming up with the court for the ball. Um, Have you noticed? Like, I don't want to say have you noticed. But, like, I be come up the court with the ball, right? My boy, like, like when I flick, like, left stick, like, down or up to, like, stop myself from dribbling, he'll do, like, a little, he'll, like, re-dribbling, right? And he'll, like, do this with the ball, like, he trying to stop himself, like, what James Harden be doing after he break somebody. Like, he'll do a step back, right? James Harden do a step back, he'll be, like, you know what I'm saying? Just to, like, to really stop himself and stop the momentum that he just got and just really pull up. So, it's clean, though, y'all. Y'all can try it out to see what I'm really talking about. I'm probably not explaining it too good, but it's clean, though, if you really want to stop sometimes and pull up you know so the size of package um like i said you know i can't really i can't dribble with the build you know what i'm saying but you can do decent little combos here and there you know what i'm saying so uh if you want to put on pro 3 from uh 2k18 if we got a new sub then or well, i can't i don't even want to say new subs but just new individuals who playing 2k if you don't know what pro 3 is bro just look it up on youtube <laughs> you know what i'm saying uh but this basically is pro 3 from uh 2k18 and they're gonna move right there you just hit it but this is the move from 2K18 to 2K17. But I found myself I would use a normal tool because I just like to do quick moves and just do like quick little hezzies. And this pack, this uh, size of package be letting me do that. You know what I'm saying? But uh, my move across over is we got on normal three. My move behind the backs. We got on normal two. Um, I did have on this one at first, but it's too wide. It's too wide. I always found myself using normal two. Uh, my moving spins is normal three. Moving hesitations is normal two. And my triple, uh, triple threat, uh, triple threat styles is normal three. My dunks, basic hand is off one, hangs off one, uh, and basic two hand is off two. You know what I'm saying? Nail package swings. You know what I'm saying? I'm soft inside the paint, so they can't let me get no good lays. You know what I'm saying? But it's all good though. But y'all, that's really about it. That's about it. Um, it ain't really too much, you know. It's just my six. Uh, we're gonna be dropping gameplay real soon, real soon. You know what I'm saying? So just stay ready for that. I just gotta drop this video for y'all, you know. So uh, my jump shot video, stay tuned if y'all new. If y'all new, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm gonna drop the jump shot video. Uh, honestly, right after this one, you know what I'm saying? So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned. But your boy Joe gonna be signing out. I don't know, I don't think they get, I don't think they hear me, but your boy Joe gonna be signing out, I hope y'all enjoyed the video, and catch me on the next one, man.